Well, yeah. uh, one of the strange things about this for me, I, I, I've done this through once as a sort of test, and um, you, you don't really know what you're doing or where you're going. Um, the paper comment is interesting. You just have to trust in getting the places. But that, that because there's no like road map or anything yes. like that, um, do, do you just follow right bits of architecture, whether you go left or right, because that's what's going to happen at that moment in the game, or do you have to go around? Can you end up going around and never find uh, anything else? You, you can, yeah. I did that about half an hour. Because I'm wondering about this, this correspondence with the physical world and whether there's actually like a blueprint and it, of, of where certain buildings and things are and they don't move, or do they move? No, it's, um, I mean, the, the world is pretty much set, mm. but uh -huh. you can wander around and kind of go farther away from the set path and things. Oh, this is the what? Is this the map? Is this the kind of map? Yeah, it's I think it is. But it's not a particularly useful one. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Escapes are always a wasteland of some sort. Yes. No man's land. It's a <laughs> There is no escape. There is no. Oh. There's no path either. There's I don't no know how path. you know where you're going, really. It's a very sure. nomad's nomad's world. We've done it before. I mean, if I was wandering this, I'd probably just be wandering around in circles. 